I'm Jessica Boyer with your SCB News Break for Thursday, June 8th. A search warrant has led to the arrest of two individuals in Sand Canyon around 10 in the morning on June 7th. 34-year-old Kristen Bell and 24-year-old Rochelle Hanks were both arrested for drug-related charges. Deputies investigated the 29100 block of Sand Canyon after receiving information about possible stolen property at the residence. A number of items were recovered, including a stolen bicycle and a large amount of cash indicating the illegal sale of narcotics. 35-year-old David Anthony Little has been charged with possess possession of child porn. Little worked at the Bouquet Canyon Road Hobby Lobby in Saugus. He is suspected of two counts of bringing obscene matter into state for sale and possession of over 600 images of child or youth pornography. If Little is convicted, he is facing a maximum sentence of five years in state prison. He's currently out on bail. We're going to take a quick break, but when we come back, find out what fundraiser is happening at William S. Hart Park. Plus, see what Amgen gave to the Hyatt Regency Valencia. Find out more after the break. Carly, did you see that? I didn't see anything, Walker. How about you, Ryder? All I see is someone doing something foolish. What's that? Someone's riding a bike at night without proper gear. You should always wear bright or reflective clothing. Never wear dark clothing after sunset. Have lights facing forwards and back. Reflectors, anything to get drivers to notice you. They won't see you if you're the same color as the night. Whether you walk, ride, or drive, share, share the, the road. road, arrive alive. evening on July 29th, head to William S. Hart Park for the Silence Under the Stars fundraiser. Wagon Tracks, a silent film featuring Hart, will be accompanied by the live talent Ray Lowe on piano. Musical Entertainment, a silent auction, and Rattlers Barbecue will take, be a part of the night too. Tickets are available at $50 a person or $500 to reserve a table for 10. All proceeds go to maintaining park grounds, barnyard animals, and the Hart Mansion. The Amgen Tour of California gave a signed Ryder jersey to the Hyatt Regency Valencia on Thursday. The Hyatt holds the honor of having the largest room block of all the hotels. Since 2007, Santa Clarita has been a host city for 13 stages of the Amgen Tour of California, which is the most in the race's history. The having uh, Amgen Tour come through is great for the business, not just because of the riders that come in as w with the tour, but also other people that are uh, cycling fans like myself that come to watch the race, uh, so it brings a lot of business in. We estimated that the actual 100,000th hotel like lights went off here in Santa Clarita, and we decided the Hyatt was the worthy recipient because they had the largest room block, and they've been our uh, unyielding, a uh, completely committed partner for the last, uh, since 2007. So um, we were delighted to partner with them again this year and we're delighted that they were the recipient of our milestone. Now turning to weather, today you can expect a high of 79 with sunny skies and a low of 59. Friday will have a high of 80 with a low of 59. Saturday and Sunday expect sunny skies again with highs in the mid-70s and lows of 54. Monday will be warm as well with a high of 79. That's all for your SCV News Break. For more local news, you can log on to hometownstation.com or scvnews.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Jessica Boyer.